Hi YouTube, I'm going to show you how to beat uh, Boathouse Jack uh, on Madhouse Difficult in Resident hey, Evil 7. One of those is mine. So after you've taken the serum from Zoe, uh, it'll auto save on Madhouse and uh, mutated Jack will grab you. Now, uh, I already speedrun the game and unlocked the circular saw and essence of defense and uh, secrets of defense. So this is going to make this boss fight a lot easier for me. I can just sit and block and it won't do much damage to me, even though it's Madhouse difficulty. And I can just aim at the eyes and take my time. I didn't use the circular saw because I wanted to see if I could beat him with a handgun fast, just with the normal bullets. But it takes ages to do any damage, so I might just use the, the circular saw. But if you're struggling on Madhouse difficulty and you've no bullets and stuff, maybe it'd be as well going back and doing a speedrun because it's really easy to beat the game under 4 hours to unlock these special weapons and make uh, Madhouse difficulty a hell of a lot easier. i will just going to change to the circular saw. And get right into him. And when you see he's about to attack, just block. Now when he's uh, when he's above you, uh, just follow the tail round, and they can't hit you. You're practically invulnerable. And uh, it's the same when he's down on the lower level. Uh, Oh, you got me there. When he's down the low level, if you want to be invulnerable, just follow his tail at the back again. I've just been greedy here, and that's why I've been hit a few times. Try to get as many of these eyes as possible while he's down. Oh, I've been greedy. That's what happens when you get greedy though, you get hit. The game punishes you, so that's a small fault though. to the enhance the handgun bullets because they do more damage. But I've not got that many bullets on that I uh, make sure I don't miss with my advanced, enhanced bullets, sorry. The problem is, uh, some of the eyes you can't see properly uh, because you've, you've damaged most of them and some of them are on the bottom and you, even when he climbs above, it's, they're blocked by that kind of wooden platform below him when he climbs up. To save getting hit, you can just uh, follow his tail round on uh, either the upper floor or uh, on the lower floor, but just... This is going to get But uh, I just wanted to try and get it done fa as fast as possible, but sometimes look, you can see that one of the eyes is on the bottom there and y you can't hit it easily. You don't have much time to hit it as he spins round. See it? So, uh, you need a bit of luck, really. Yeah, I've got one of the eyes underneath him. You can see how easy it makes the game having the circular saw and uh, 
see the secrets of defense and the essence of defense because I mean, look, anytime you block it, it doesn't do any damage. Right, so I've got the one on his arm. Look, there's one there on his belly, but it's really hard to hit that one. See, oh, look, it's off again. Bloody hell. It's that one that it's always blocked by that wooden platform. It's really annoying. I don't tend to fight him upstairs because uh, he can hit you easier upstairs. Yeah, I've got one of the ones on his belly there. I think there's still one in his tail. Yeah, there is. I don't know if that's the last one though. Look, as I said, look, you follow the tail round and he can never hit you because he's stuck in a loop of spinning until he climbs back down. Oh, and look, he's, he's changed the direction, so follow the tail the other way around now. But see, there's that bloody eye that's just stuck there. Oh, I was lucky enough to get it. That was jammy. Right. Have I damaged all the eyes? No, there's still one in the tail. It's <laughs> gonna get me. <laughs> yeah, this one in the tail's a pain in the ass as well because it keeps climbing and moving it. So you need to be quick to you need to have good aiming on this one. You'd be as well leaving the tail one till he climbs down. Because try to shoot it from uh, below while he's above you is just pointless. It's just a waste of bullets, I would say. So just keep following this tail round in a kind of anti-clockwise motion, and you'll see that uh, he'll follow you. And that he'll just eventually climb down because he can't hit you. And that's your chance to go run to the back and then follow the tail round. And as you can see, he can't hit you when you're following the tail round at the back either. So if uh, you don't have the essence of defence or the secrets of defence and you can't block him, always follow his tail round on this lower level and then uh, take a pot shot at one of his eyes when, uh, when you get an opportunity. Yeah, finally got it. Wait, I mean you've done enough damage to climbs under the water. And that's that gets the second stage of the fight, you think of one. Right, so now you need to shoot his eye and block. I'm using the the Albert uh, the special gun you get at the end of the game for completing the game once. The Albert Zero One or something I think it's called. Yeah, and when you've done enough damage the door will open and so you'll start talking to you. But that's you still need to inject him with the serum. And the good thing is you get a auto save on the boat ride, I think. On Madhouse difficulty you get an auto save either on the boat or after the boat when you wake up. And I would recommend seeing the second half of the fight when you're just shooting his eye, uh, use enhanced bullets for that to make it faster. Well, thanks for watching YouTube, and if you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Right? Hopefully, you can beat it as well. I'll yeah. see you later. Come on, meet up waiting for us.